magnetic floor. What, you can't jump or maybe? Uh, you get there's like random magnetic uh, flare ups or something. Oh my god. <laughs> Watch my upper. Oh god! Wow. <laughs> it's like Mortal Kombat 1 uppercut damage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the lightning got him? Yeah. Is a douche. That's not nice. Test your luck. <laughs> Tron Bun. <laughs> Tron G. Heavy damage. Bad high ground. Ice rockets. Meteor combat. Health DJ. Floor of flame. Dark combat. Round that's the moment I knew that Capcom would just never care about Mega Man again. What? This is when Tron Bond made it into Marvel vs. Capcom 3, but he... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was, that was a dark day. I really don't know why they just, they hate their own... Like, why wouldn't they do things with that character? It, it does puzzle me. You reboot that dude, it's a license to print money. I think. What if there's some sort of weird, like, legal issue around it that they don't talk about? Yeah, you gotta wonder. Because, I mean, it's, it's like, it's not like companies are averse to bringing back old, you know, 8 bit era classic characters, and Mega Man was. like one of the biggest video game characters in the world for a while, at one point. I mean, Mario, they... St Mario, like, you don't think of him as an 8-bit era character, even though he is. It's just like, because they never stopped, you know? Yeah. He's just a household name. They never stopped making games. I remember you said something I really liked once, like, you just, like, like Mega Man, like, like a 3D Mega Man is sort of like a cartoonier version of, like, Vanquish's graphics stuff. Yes. I think that would really work. That would be my, that was what I would do. That sounds like a cool idea. We've had like 10 games with like the old style thing. Yeah. It's like if they were ever going to redo it. It is kind of weird. It is weird that they don't. And then for the hell, you know, they can still make, make throwback games too, you know what I mean? Win win. Ow! Does he have double damage? I think. Yeah, it's so weird to me. I actually wonder. I do wonder if there's some sort of like. Uh, some sort of issue with the legal rights to the character or something like that, because it's, it's really yeah. weird otherwise. It's strange. I wonder whatever happened to that Mighty Number no. 9 thing. That's still in, that's still been in production. Still going? Mm -hmm. That's cool. That's still in production. Is it going to come out for this generation? Yeah. Cool. And that was like one of the, the creators, right? The KG, one. yeah, KG something or other. KG and Fune. They brought back the woman who did the original music as well. All oh, my special moves are mixed up. I'm doing the input for the teleport right now, and oh. he's doing the leg grab. <laughs> the leg grab is the spear. Select a new fighter. Oh, dude, look at this variation for Sub Zero. This is cool. It's 
It's called Blue Steel. Blue Steel. It's like two. It was two bucks, you know. Mm -hmm. and I'm like, why not? Because it like donates to like the tournament like fund or something. What tournament fund? I don't know. Some there's a bunch of people play tournaments and crap, and there's money involved. But it's like if you donate to that, you get this Blue Steel Sub Zero thing. Okay. I was playing this with Ken the other day, and he's like, he looks like Batman the Animated Series Sub Zero. Sub -Zero. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, that's perfect. <laughs> he totally does. <laughs> why? Why not? Why not? Hope is death. <laughs> That's actually from the game, as I recall. Yeah. Batman, uh... What was that called? Oh, it was for PS2. Yeah, I know what you mean. Is that a good game? It was at the time. I haven't played it in a long time. I don't know if it holds up or anything. Some games. Yeah. Wait, striker says the character is that like the character striker? Uh, I think it just drops in bombs or. Well, I know that, but the face on it, I mean. Yes. Brutality combat. I don't know any of his brutality. Powerful jump yeah. attacks. I think it means you could do a brutality at any point in the match. <laughs> what? Yeah. It's just like 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 time killers where you could just chop someone's head off at any moment. Yeah, it must be more than forty seconds remaining. Full screen distance. Opponent must be frozen, and final hit must come from an ice blast. Oh yeah, like Ermac's gonna stay away. Might be a really close in character. <laughs> there's like, there's bombs, there's lightning, there's, there's hell hands. Ah, <laughs> jeez! <laughs> God, this is obnoxious. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> ah. Imagine like a fighting game series where like Oh, he did. Oh. Just yeah, okay, so just brutality at any moment. Yeah. <laughs> Sucks that you lost, but that was that was that was awesome. <laughs> yeah. Also, are there, there going to be like a there's going to be no round 2, I guess? <laughs> yeah. Cuz well, oh. I mean, your head is gone, so. Yep. Sucks that you lost, but that was pretty funny. <laughs> It doesn't really matter if you win or lose during test your luck. <laughs> I mean, you want to win, but... Easily wounded. What's that mean? Bleeding. Oh, no, that's what bleeding would do. Easily wounded, I mean... It... Wait! Okay, maybe you just take more damage, I guess. <laughs> so much bullshit on the screen. <laughs> Jumps kind of. Test my it'd, be, it'd be kind of funny. Run. Have a match with like just like all the you know the, like the random stuff that can come in and hurt you. Just like ma all of that. Yeah. Lightning strikes, the striker attacks, falling bombs, ice rockets, yeah. hell hands. I don't know where that that mode is where you can like choose your own. Or... Maybe you have to unlock it. <gasps> oh, what? Headbutt. Is he gonna lose power before I do? You know, considering in the first, in the in Mortal Kombat 9, Ermac, you know, like came up to Jax and just sort of looked at him and just tore his arms off with a thought. So like, how does Ermac ever lose? Right. <laughs> I mean, it's probably an, ex an extra amount of concentration that has to go. Maybe. With that. Although, he was in his soul chamber at the time, wasn't he? Yeah, he did. Maybe that made him. He did just walk out of it. Yeah. I mean, it's very important that we explain this rationally. <laughs> I'm gonna look for that real quick.
Kung Lao on ice. <laughs> Special? All mixed up. You don't know what to do. <laughs> you turn around to find the person. <laughs> Round one. Fight. Capcom Capcom maintains an official Mega Man website. Oh really? Yeah. Could use some. Could use some updating though. The second to most recent news item is Capcom unveils Mega Man 9 for digital download. Really? So. Oh wow. That was what, like 2008 or something? Time to be alive. <laughs> Panning lasers? <laughs> what does Bag of Tricks do? Seems to just send like. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That's Moon Boots, huh? Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of those lasers. It's like turning into like that Resident Evil scene. Yeah. Where like Where, half the cast died yeah. from lasers in a zombie movie. Because no one wants to see people being killed by zombies in a movie like that. Goodness no. Ow. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Do those shell casings just stay there? Did they? I think so. That's pretty cool. Unless they dissolve them. No, they're later. still there. Oh, wow. Hey, Johnny? Yeah, Cassie Cage has like multiple genital based uh, attacks, doesn't she? Her dad, huh? I guess. Ow, ow, ow. Are those lasers hurting you, or? Yeah, I think just a little bit. Oh, okay. oh I see. Yeah. yeah, like they don't knock you down or whatever. They just kind of sear off some health. Okay. Okay, I got you. She said you're just a total bitch. <laughs> I thought I heard her say that. Oh! Whoa! Wait, did the laser maker explode? No. I think it's just explosive combat. I think that was one of them. Really? It might have been. <laughs> 